Hello everyone, Ice Cool Tech here. We're gonna be taking a look at how the iPhone 7 has held up on iOS 14 Developer Beta 4. And before we get into the video, as always, if you are new to the channel, definitely make sure to hit that subscribe button with notifications turned on to stay up to date with more content just like this. Every subscriber truly does mean a lot and it's very appreciated. Anyways, let's get straight into the video iOS 14 Developer Beta 4 released last Tuesday bringing a new TV widget, the exposure notification tab on the main settings page, plenty of tweaks and many fixes. Now we saw a few fixes for the weather widget, return of 3D touch for compatible devices, the ability to use exposure notifications on iOS 14, app library section header corrections, and many other fixes. Now performance while running iOS 14 Developer Beta 4 on the iPhone 7 has actually been excellent. Just like with the iPhone SE, apps tend to launch very quickly and web pages load up fast. I've had no issue in terms of general performance. Now, RAM management has also been pretty good. I haven't experienced too many reloads and I'm able to keep the apps open for a decent amount of time. Now, RAM management on this beta of iOS 14 isn't much different than it was on iOS 13. Now, animations have also been great for the most part. Just like with the iPhone SE, I've noticed that animations such as swiping to access the notification and control centers, opening and closing apps, closing apps with the multitasking screen, etc. have all been incredibly smooth. Even simply swiping between home screen pages have been very, very fluid. Although I've had one very annoying issue return. If you've been watching my videos for a while, you can probably guess what that is. Yes, the iPhone 7 missing unlock animation bug is back in beta 4. This is perhaps the very first thing I noticed after updating. Now when unlocking the iPhone 7, occasionally the unlock animation will just not happen. This only happens every so often, so it's not too bad, but actually it is. Of course, with my luck, this missing animation is also paired with another issue that I've talked about in the past as well. This issue is stuttering, really bad stuttering. After quickly unlocking the iPhone, I'll notice that every system animation stutters dramatically and some are even missing. Now this time around, the stuttering stays for about 10 seconds before correcting itself, and I really hope to see a fix for this soon. Before I get into battery, I should take a second to mention that my iPhone 7 is running off of a maximum battery capacity of 93% and has never had a restart. Now this means that my iPhone 7 is not being throttled to maintain, maintain battery life or prevent restarts. Now battery life on the iPhone 7 while running iOS 14 developer beta 4 has actually been great. This is the only iPhone that I've not had any battery drain on while running beta 4. The battery life has definitely improved over iOS 13, and I could even say it's been better than beta 3. Standby time has also been excellent, especially considering that this is a major beta. Now, I've only noticed a drain of about 2-4% overnight. Now that is incredible, and I really, really hope it stays that way. I've even had to take some extra time to make sure that I was truly getting true and consistent results. Now another good thing is the fact that overheating seems to have been reduced to a minimum or completely eliminated. Personally, I still experience very slight overheating, but it's not too common and the iPhone doesn't get too hot. Many others have seen the same results with Beta 4 and we can only hope that this just improves. Now of course, the main question, should you update? Well, my answer is pretty simple. If you're on any earlier version of iOS and you're not comfortable installing beta firmware, then don't update. If you're on an earlier version of iOS and you are okay with installing beta firmware or you're on an earlier beta of iOS 14, I'd say there really isn't a reason not to update. Overall, iOS 14 Developer Beta 4 is a very stable beta release with the worst issues really being a missing unlock animation and stuttering. Other than that, beta 4 brings many promising fixes and improvements. Now, as always, if you have any questions, make sure to leave a comment down below. All right, everyone, that is all I have for this video. If you did enjoy the video or found it helpful in any way, show me by leaving a like. And if you are new to the channel, definitely make sure to hit that subscribe button. Every subscriber really does mean a lot and it's very appreciated. Now, don't forget to check out the iSchool Tech official Discord link in the description down below as always. And also make sure to follow me on Twitter using the link in the description. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you in the next one.